Commitment is what makes a man a man. Come on, guys. If you want the desired result of being a man, which what does mean being a man mean? It means taking on responsibility. It means being committed. Until you are fully committed in every single area of your life, you are not a man. You are still becoming a man. And we all are becoming a man as we go along this journey from child to early to teenage, adolescence to early adulthood to early manhood to being a man to older man, middle aged man, older man, elderly, all of that great stuff, right? But commitment and responsibility, your commitment to your woman, your commitment to your business, your commitment to your purpose, your commitment to your fitness, to your nutrition, to being the best version of yourself, your commitment to God, right? The Ten Commandments of Jesus, right? You, your commitment to the Ten Commandments, your commitment to your woman with your eyes, your thoughts, your words, your actions, your commitment to your woman, your commitment to your children, to be the father, your future children, if you're young like myself. My my future my girlfriend is my future wife, future wife, right? But my commitment to her is what makes me a man. My commitment to my dreams, my purpose, my vision, my goals is what makes me a man. To the level of commitment you have, to the level of responsibility you have is going to be the level of masculinity you have, right? The more you put off your responsibility onto other people, the less committed you are in your fitness, your health, your finances, your business, your purpose in life, your woman, your relationships, the, the more you throw off commitments and you're just a half committed ass motherfucker, you are not a man. <laughs> My profanity, right? My profanity. You are not a man if you're not committed, right? So you need to check yourself and ask yourself on a scale of one to 10, zero to 110, 100%, right? How committed am I to my finance goals, to my goals, to my relationship, to my woman, to my children, to my future children, to my parents, to, to the goals and the vision that I have to God? How committed am I? Is my every thought, word, and action in align with that commitment? Right, so if you have a fitness goal, for example, because I'm a mindset fitness coach, DC Fitness, this is Devin Cripe with DC Fitness and my Spartan Gods, right? If you have a fitness goal of getting a six pack or losing 20, 30 pounds, if you're 100% committed, you don't eat that donut, you don't eat that slice of pizza, you don't miss a day of not tracking your macros, you don't miss a workout, right? If you're 100% committed to your wake up time, to being the best version of yourself and following through with your work schedule and all of your goals, you don't miss your wake up time. Right? If you're 100% committed to your business, to your purpose, to your financial goals, right? You don't miss your daily targets, right? You're, you're prospecting, your hours work. You said, I'm going to work 10 hours a day, seven days a week for a whole year and see where I am financially and see where my business is at. I'm going to contact a thousand people a week for the next year. 52 weeks straight. And I'm going to see where my real estate business is. I'm going to see where my coaching business is, right? Your commitments to your business, to your goals is going to be the level of results you have. So your commitment to your woman is going to be the commitment of the results you get, right? Me and my girlfriend been going through a lot of issues yesterday with another crazy fight, right? But guess what? Guess what? Through all of emotions, through all fights, this uh, the state of mind that you have to have that I have when I'm in a fight with my girlfriend or let's say I only get four hours of sleep. I only got four hours of sleep last night. Guess what? I still woke up at 5 a.m. Guess what? I still crushed my workout. I still ran four miles today and crushed my weights workout. Guess what? I'm still going to work eight, 10, 12 hours today. I'm still going to fall through with my business commitments, with my relationship, with everything. Even though I only got four hours of sleep, I'm still going to do what I said I was going to do. Fall through with my commitments because I'm a committed. I'm serious about my goals, right? I got a big fight with my girlfriend yesterday, but guess what? That tests, that tests, right? Guess what? That test is my commitment. My commitment is how if how much can the world throw at you? How much? How many? Because it, obviously, working through things, going through fights, and and going through going through trials and tribulations and failures is actually imagine putting yourself in the state of mind. This is actually testing God or life or the universe is testing my commitment and seeing am I really committed to this woman? Devin, do you really mean your promise? Devin, are you really going to marry this girl? Well, let's see how much you want it. Let's see how much you love her. Let's see how committed you are. Hey, Devin, you say you want to be a millionaire, multi-millionaire, hundred millions a year, billion a year. You want to be the biggest, baddest business, biggest purpose, impact millions and millions of people. You say you want to do that. Well, how, how long will you work? How long will you wait? How patient can you be? How committed are you? 
Will these show up day in and day out despite the result? What if you work every single day, give your life, blood, sweat, and tears, and I didn't give you that result for 20 years? Would you do it? Are you that committed to your purpose? Mm. How about your fitness goals? You want to be big. You want to be swole like the rock. You want to be huge, right, Devin? Right? Right, Robbie? Right, Johnny? Right, Bob? You want to be committed to your goals, right? You want to be swole. You want to be shredded. You want to be ripped, ripped, rich, and rare, right? Well, what if it took you 10 years of showing up every single day? Are you willing to do that for your goals? Are you willing to? Because you have to be that level of committed to actually reach the goal. I can tell you from the financial success I've already ha accomplished, from the business success I've already accomplished, already helping hundreds of men, right? From all the tribulations and failures of being homeless and growing up in poverty around drug abuse and everything that I've been through, through, you know, relationship issues and everything that I've been through. I can tell you to the level of commitment you have, that's going to be directly correlated to the results that you have. Because I know right now, the reason I have been successful is due to my work, due to my mindset, due to my investments, due to my risks, due, due to what I've learned from my application, right? And my really overall, my commitment level to what? My personal development of being and becoming the best version of myself, reaching my goals, reaching my vision, and, and just showing up and being the best I can every day for my people, for my family, for my purpose. And that is the level of results I have. So let me put, be, let me be more and do more for a longer amount of time and be committed for another three years, five years, 10 years, 20 years, and let's see where I am with my purpose, business, financial, fitness, relationship. Let's see how amazing my relationship, my business, and every every area of life is if I show up every single day and give everything I got, my blood, sweat, and tears, my heart, my body, my soul, my mind, to everything that I do for three, five, 10, 20 more years. And let's see what type of external results I get. But guess what? We're not, if we don't validate ourselves, we validate ourselves based off the process of doing what we can, being the best we can, and every single day getting better. Being, being and becoming the best version of ourselves in every single given moment. And that's all of our purposes, right? All right, this is Devin Cripe with DC Fitness coming from Los Angeles, California, Orange County, actually, um, right? And uh, so, yeah, if you guys like the video make sure you like the video subscribe to the channel click the notification button so you never miss a video if you guys want to join my coaching program mindset fitness nutrition get in complete alignment to crush not only your fitness goals but every goal you have in life financial business purpose personal relationship all of that right join my spartan gods community and join dc fitness and join my coaching program you can find me at devincripe.com to learn more about it and you can message me at instagram or facebook at devincripe other than that guys have a wonderful day god bless Let's get it. Let's go.